Hello YouTube, this is going to be another MMD PMD tutorial and this one's actually going to be a little bit of a refresher. Um, I had one person in particular ask me about it, but I've also had several others ask me about it. Um, so this video is simply going to be a, a very slow um, description of after you've downloaded your base and everything you want to put on it. Uh, just what exactly you do to make everything not turn white and to make everything work. So, the first thing that you have to do is, of course, you download your base. And when you open it, there should be a bunch of files in it already. And those are texture files. Those have to stay with this. They have to no matter what. Your base folder doesn't matter where you put it, but as long as everything is all together, then it's perfectly fine. So, um, if it, first of all, if it does not look like this, there's a big possibility the person you downloaded it from just forgot to add everything in. And there's some bases that actually already have everything on just the one file itself. That usually doesn't happen. Normally, you'll just see all of this. So, once you have all of that, you go ahead and drag your model onto PMD. And if your model still comes out white, there is a very high possibility that the model is defective. One of the things that I recommend doing is to upload it on MMD as well. And if it still does not work on MMD, that means that model is just very bad and you need to try downloading another one. So if your model looks like this, that's awesome. That's already the first step. So... After you've got your model up, of course, you're going to want to add hair or whatever else to it. And so to do that, obviously go download your hair, shoes, whatever. And let's see, I'm just going to pick some random hair here. And so sometimes hair will already have a texture file in it, but if you don't want that texture, it's fine. Um, so let's go ahead and put this on here. Always click add. Okay, and the hair will come up. The hair does not have a texture on it right now because the hair was brought on to a completely different um, set of, um, you know, like it wasn't, it was added on, it wasn't brought in new. So to add on a texture, what you have to do is you can either use a texture that was already in there or you can download a hair texture, which is uh, usually what I always do. So I'm just going to go ahead and pick a random one here. But whichever one you decide you want, you go ahead and copy it. Don't cut it. Just keep it in its folder. Go ahead and copy that. You go back to your base folder. And you go ahead and paste the texture in there. After you do that, you have to come over to your model. After you've already fixed the hair and everything, I'm not going to worry about doing that. Um... You come back to your model, you come to this box, you go to MA, you go to your hair um, block, and you type in whatever the texture's name was. So in this case, it was hair3.bmp. Okay, well, this is already halfway there for me, so that's awesome. And sometimes, at first, it won't come up immediate like that. If, it's, if it does that, don't worry about it. Um, the only thing you got to do is when you have your subscreen up, just push up this little U right here, it's an update button, and then the hair should um, show up. Okay, so that's what you do for that, and for every other thing you add onto the model, that's literally all you do. If you wanna add on clothes, you do the same thing. Just make sure you select everything that is in the clothes file and put it in your models folder. And if there are, th there are things that are still white after you do it, just double check to make sure everything was spelled right, you put stuff in the right place, uh, etc. And again, as with the model, if it is still white, that just means it's not going to work pretty much no matter what you do. Um, I have tried several different things to get that stuff to work, but I can never get it to work. So if anybody um, uh, knows you know, how to get that to work or what's wrong with it, please, please definitely say something um, in the description. So, one more time, just going through it really, really quick. You download your model, and in your model folder, 
everything should already be in here for you. And once you've downloaded something else, downloaded the hair or whatever, you take the texture you wanted to use for the hair and put it in your models folder. And you do the same thing with the clothes, with the shoes, with literally everything you are adding onto the model, you have to put into this folder. If you want, you can even put the hair folder into your, um, into your models folder, which is not a bad idea. So I hope this video cleared stuff up a little bit for everybody. Um, if you still have more questions, um, definitely please feel free to leave a comment. And again, if stuff is still still coming out white for you, I'll try to help you with it. But um, again, generally, if it's white, even though you're doing everything correct, it probably means you just you just can't use it. So again, please feel free to leave any comments, questions, concerns. Uh, down in the comment section and stay tuned for the next video.